Now listen, I say, listen to me when I'm talking to you, girl. You're just letting that little old pie-sized beast beat the fuss out of you like a boxing roo. Kangaroo, that is. And now look at you. You're just, I say, you're just lying there like a dead deer carcass in the middle of the road. What happened to your fighting spirit, young lady? Did you lose your spark? You lost it. Roll right away from you like a dropped penny. You don't look like the toughest fighter to me. More like the roughest stick in the mud. Come on, I say, come on, girl. Pick yourself up, get out of there, and fight like a man. Man, that is. Make your sisters proud of you, just like how I wanted to make that hand Miss Pretty proud of me. Look, kid, I understand what you're going through, and it ain't pretty. Look at you. Your do, I say your do's a real best. Looks like a briard with a bad grooming job. Mange, that is. And you're just letting all those folks, even your own sisters, laugh at you like a bunch of hyenas. What kind, I say, what kind of a person are you, girl? A pushover? Come on, don't lose faith in yourself all because you look like you've been run over by a tractor. You gotta stop tripping over your own toes. Toes, that is, if you been have any. And show some confidence, young lady. It's not, I say, not the end of the world, kid. That red-headed mane of yours is gonna grow back eventually, and then those folks will stop treating you like a complete monkey. Well, I certainly didn't know I needed to hear those words, especially after such an awful day. Thanks, Mr. Leghorn.